Well, the CEO of UP Health System, Marquette, is spreading his vision for a hospital changes after a discussion today with community leaders. And tonight, TV6's Nicole Buckman digs deeper into the challenges faced by health care providers and how UP Health System is responding. In the midst of chaos, there's also opportunity. This is just one quote used by CEO Brian Sinot today to sum up what's going on with healthcare nationally and locally. Just to better understand healthcare, it's a very complicated, ever-changing industry right now. And it's something that we need to start better educating people in our community. Our community is very passionate about the hospital. I love that. And so I'd like to start doing a role or helping out in the education portion of it. The presentation broke down where the U.S. stands nationally in quality and cost of health care to explain how it's not just the UP health system who is struggling. According to Sinot, 12 hospitals have already closed this year and says confronting change is the way to move forward. Those that are willing to change right now can position themselves to succeed long term very quickly by focusing on quality and service and also looking at greater efficiencies. So amidst this chaos in our industry, I see great potential. Sinat says the change he sees in the UP is in building up systems of care and focusing on fundamentals. We are 100% focused on quality and service. Uh, we've got to connect with our community and tell our story and celebrate our many successes. There are miracles happening here every day when we just need to be better about telling that story. Sinat says by sharing success will move past any negative perception on the hospital, which is currently causing out-migration problems. According to Sina, $100 million is lost by people getting care in Wisconsin. UP Health hopes to cut that by 10%. I've got the entire team very focused on what are those near-term goals and wins that we have to go get, and then we'll take on that next step. Sinat says the hospital is past the struggling point and on to stabilization with hopes of moving towards their mission with the opening of the new hospital next year. Nicole Buckman, TV6 News, Marquette.